you want to know fun facts? This is the third time I've tried to film this video. Every time, every time, it's got some sort of issue where it's just too <laughs> quiet. <laughs> and, or, well, I mean, yeah, I just haven't been able to record it. I've tried so many times. Um, anyway, here we are. Um, I'm really annoyed because I just did ten whole minutes. And for some reason I decided not to check if the audio sounded any good. Um, oh, it didn't say that anyway, so that's fine. Um, we'll start a new game. Anyway, <laughs> hi. <laughs> it's me. I'm here again. Um, okay. So, it's been a little while. It's been at least, what, two, three months? We're currently in the year of our Lord. 2013. I am 16 years old. About the starry sky uh, at night so loud. Hold on. Strange and mysterious things would soon be happening. Hello, okay. As unsuspecting muggles slept, a huge motorbike with a giant astride it tumbled down from the darkness. He's a big boy. The giant named Hagrid. <laughs> that looks like shit. On the doorstep of number four, Privet Drive. If that was Before fucking... The bundle was a baby. If that's not my doorstep, Potter, I'd be punting that into high heaven. Lived. I'm sorry, that was For the next terrifying. For years, Harry lived with his dreadful step-parents, the Dursleys. Until that fateful day, when he received the letter inviting him to attend Hogwarts School of Witchcraft and, and Wizardry. Wizardry. Hagrid took Harry to Diagon Alley to purchase a most unusual list of school supplies. Soon after, Harry caught the Hogwarts Express from Platform 9 and 3 quarters and left the muggle world far behind. <laughs> Harry sat beneath the sorting My audio is a mess. Hoping I'm sorry. Hoping not be chosen for Slytherin <laughs> House over Gryffindor. Oh. Slytherin, eh? Set the hat in his ear. You could be great. It's all here in your head, and Slytherin will help you on your way to greatness. I support you sorting out. Well, well, if you're sure... Fuck you. Fuck you, Slytherin <laughs> You fuck me over, Slytherin hat. Slytherin was the one. Gryffindor is the worst, the worst fucking house. It is the lamest, boy. The lamest. The music sounds like shit. Fucking <laughs> Dumbledore <laughs> looks like shit too. Look at him. I'm speaking ill of the dead a little. Dumbledore, your headmaster. Now, Hogwarts is full of secrets, Harry. So search behind every door, but keep in mind... Not all secrets are rewarding. Oh, um... Insane. I don't know why I skipped that. Um, <laughs> well, essentially, he just said, if you end up on the third floor, you'll die, which is crazy. Like, that's a little bit of negligence, is it not? If a teacher came up to you and said, "Okay, Bravo. fucking hell," tweak four wonderful words, don't you think? This guy's <laughs> he's on something. Let me tell you, what kind of teacher goes? Oh, uh, go enter in any fucking door, any door you see, you could go into. Uh, but also <sighs> avoid the third floor because you you will die. Yeah, you know, just <sighs> you don't want to die, right? So just uh, don't don't die. Oh hell yeah! Who's this guy? Ooh! Cool. I'll give it a go. Cool. Mm, stop talking. He's still talking. Okay. Right. Yeah. So it is the year of our Lord 2013. I haven't uploaded a video in like two or three months. Haha. <laughs> Um, as I'm quirky and funny, you see. <sighs> I thought it'd be funny if I start off a video being like, Oh, haha, it is actually 2013. It hasn't been eight years since I uploaded a video. And I'd be like, haha, I never heard of coronavirus, but that wouldn't be very funny. That would just be a bit depressing, I think. So I'm not going to do that. <laughs> That's about it, really. That's all i got to tell you. Um... So we're playing this. I did actually genuinely try and play this around 2013. It was probably the last video I recorded. 
in 2013, and I, I don't know, I don't know, I thought the video was alright actually, but I just never ended up uploading it, and now, um, unless I did, no I didn't, I didn't upload it, and now we're here, and we've got this, this ugly fucking game, <laughs> but I used to love him as a child, so, that's alright, that's all crying. that's all crying. whoop, fucking idiot, just walk down the stairs like a normal human being, fucking state of friend George, mind. By the look of that scar, I'm Fred Harry Potter. It's my brother, George. Hello there, Harry. We have a proposal for you. In Hogwarts, there are special portraits, and behind these special portraits are prizes. Portraits mean but prizes. Not just anyone can open up the portrait. You need to know the password. If you bring us earwax every flavour bean, we'll tell you the password. We'll be in the Gryffindor common room, which is through the portrait of the fat lady. Hmm. See you around, Harry. Waitest. Bit of a rude. It's a secret door. I knew that. I found it last time. And it was exciting. And then I was like, oh, it's not exciting this time. If it's just like... I think I genuinely remember this from playing as a kid, which is... Ah. Uh, Merlin. No, because I wasted my time. Um, You press square on the little... Bookshelves. And then a secret passage. The thin, the thin ones, not the thick ones, thick, sexy ones. And then you got these ones. <sighs> Look at that shit. <laughs> my fucking my wand's got ED. Puff of smoke. Just, <laughs> I'm just wandering around. Ah, wand's not. Oh wow, it's even out of, out of dust now. Smoke. Um. Imagine that. I think that's a feature I want in every single AAA game. Press A to dust. <laughs> well, I want my Forza Horizon. I want my Skyrim 2. I want my Last of Us 3. When you press X, you go pst. That's what I want. That's what I want in video hey, games. Harry, remember me? John Weasley? No. That slimy Slytherin Draco Malfoy ran through this door with an owl under his arm. We've all been there. I think it was your owl Hedwig. Let's go after him. It probably was Hedwig. But it would be very funny if it wasn't. It's just a different owl. And I went, oh, never mind. Uh, keep that owl. There's no mine. Yeah, like, have they even explained who Hedwig is? Come on. Well, well, well. Is if he's the famous, famous Harry Potter. I'm Draco Malfoy. And okay. Well to show the respect. <laughs> Looking for that owl, of See. Course. How careless of you to leave it blind. Go home to your mother, Potter. Oh, sorry. <laughs> oh my God. This guy is brutal. I'm sorry, that was probably horrible for the years. That, this guy is the worst. And it's very funny. It's awful. That's the worst thing I've ever heard, maybe. And I've played this game so many times, but I think I just forgot how awful it was. Come on, Harry. Follow me. Also, how much of a safety hazard is this place where you just have to climb up things? Like... Why is this here? If you're in the middle of a corridor, what are that, at this, why are they here? For what purpose do they serve? Okay. For what purpose do they serve? <laughs> like, who are they helping? It's random. Oh, yeah, we've got a bit of wood on the floor. you just got to jump over it. Rooms like this, right? Mm. He goes mm, when he jumps. To jump, mm -hmm. just approach the edge and keep pressing forwards on the controller. Okay. It's good life advice that everyone could follow. Actually, that's how you have to. That's how you got to jump now. They've changed it. I'll double back and watch the entrance. You better go on and rescue Hedwig. President Joe Biden came up and was like, "You just you jump differently now. You just have to run and then you jump automatically. You don't need to do anything. It's pretty cool." Pretty neat, pretty tidy. Cool. Oh. I did it! I did the feathers, and then they went boom boom. <sighs> Trust me, I think I like this game. I think it's a good game. It might just be the nostalgia talking, and I'm sure it is. But. Hello, Harry Potter. My name is Nearly Headless Nick, and I am the Gryffindor House Ghost. Look how tall this room is. Well, I mean, you must go all the way to the top to get out. <laughs> If you want to look around, press your triangle button. Press the triangle button again when you've finished. Cool. Um, 
I'm gonna say it's the 10 minute mark. That's around a decent time to stop for now. Maybe I'll do a part two in another eight years. Maybe I'll see you in 2029. I will be. How old am I now? I'll be 33. Uh, maybe I'll see you then. <laughs> bye bye. How do I stop recording? Okay, bye bye.